and we're going to be making this today out of this. So here we have the, the Chinese racing radially mounted four pot brake caliper all for about I don't know 50 bucks I don't know who RPM are or RPM racing I wonder if they've got a team or a program I wonder if they do any research maybe they just copy people who knows but I wonder if these bolts are even rated I wonder if you can even buy these pads that nah, all questions for another day but this is going on the cheap boy Chinese pit bike forks and as you know, or as you saw, those are actually mounted. So it comes with this adapter, axial to radial, but this does not work with the size of wheels and disc my mate's using. So he 3D printed this bad boy. So it's going to fit on this somewhere like that. And we're gonna contour the whole thing and use some adaptive tool paths and yeah it should look bloody professional although we won't know till the end so here's the setup it looks real shoddy we have one tow clamp because the piece of stock is obviously scrap and obviously the part just fits on there because we have to contour the entire piece there's nowhere else to put on a clamp, although it's sitting off the table on these three and a half, four mil ish spaces, and that's nice and tight under there. Um, yeah, we'll see how we go. So that last setup was far less than ideal. So what I did was drill and tap a couple of the holes beforehand, and then bolt the stock to another piece of aluminium and hold it in my vise way better. I'd also like to apologize for not getting as much footage of the machining as I would have liked but I got a bit distracted and oh well. I machined these two small locating bosses on the mill and then moved the vise straight over to the drill press to tap the holes. All in all, not a bad effort. You can see I've even machined a logo on there. Made a couple boo-boos where it collided when doing the engraving. Otherwise, pretty good. I used Fusion's flat feature to get a nice step over while ignoring the walls on all of the flat surfaces. Some chamfers. And I used the contour or the finishing pass. So there are no vertical line or no lines in the part. Otherwise, yeah, turned out really good for half a day's work. And I'm happy with that considering we started out with a shitty drawing. And it's only for a $40 Chinese caliper. If I was going to do anything differently, I might make up some soft jaws and actually for the back edge of the part although in the end we just did it with a file but yeah she looks like I bought one also let me know below in the comments if you guys want to see weekly fortnightly mostly weekly updates of what I'm up to they won't have much in the way of editing but they'll just be a quick honest look at what I'm doing that week <laughs> 